In a school somewhere located in the Adelaide suburbs lived a tiny menace to the world environment. Although this enemy is tiny in stature, many of his kind are born every day. This foe can be stamped on, walked over, ignored, and even survive bone-crushing kicks. The year is 2013, and the school community is losing the war against Doug and his kind. Doug is a plastic drink container. Okay, girls, do you know who Doug is? No. You've never seen Doug walking around the school? No. He's been everywhere. You sure you haven't seen Doug? Yeah. Do you know what Doug looks like? No. <laughs> okay, alright, thank you girls. The Doug experiment. Rule number one. I am to place the empty bottle, known as Doug, in random locations across the school. Rule number two. I am to stop filming when the bottle has been physically manipulated or moved. And rule number three. If a student picks up the bottle and puts it in the bin on his or her own accord, the experiment is over. Good luck, Doug.
Okay, boys, do you know who Doug is? No. No. You haven't seen Doug in the yard? No. You sure? No. He's been everywhere, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and you haven't seen him? No. Do you know what Doug looks like? No. <laughs> All right, thank you very much. Hi guys, do you know what litter or rubbish is? Yes. What would you say that is? Um, it's like um, people like throwing away their rubbish and not putting it like in the bin and it's like making our environment. Okay. Like Can you tell me some types of rubbish? Apples. Um, rubbish is out of containers and fruit boxes. Okay. What else? What other types of rubbish have you seen? Um, lots of, um, like, um, like, the thing that you wrap the sandwich in and lots of them around and, like, yogurt. Okay. Yogurt. Also, like, uh, you see chip packets everywhere and left tins and, um, fruit boxes and stuff. Where do you see rubbish, do you think? Usually sometimes in garden, okay. gardens and... What about in school? Where do you see rubbish? In the um, bushes. In the bushes and in the gardens. In the piazza, in the bushes, out over, uh, out over the oven. And, it's very and in the bin. And mostly it's in the bushes because people think um, that it's like a stashy place. Sounds like a lot of places for rubbish, doesn't it? Yes. Okay, thank If you saw some rubbish on the oval, yeah. what would you do? Pick it and put it in the bin. Okay. Where have you seen rubbish before? I would take it and I would put it in the bin. Okay. What would you do with it? I would pick it up and I would put it in the bin.
battle for a cleaner school environment will continue to be fought against Doug and his rubbish friends. This is not a war that will be ended in one day or one year. Doug and his litter army will continue to spread across schools, homes, oceans and the world. To win this war we don't need weapons, superpowers or armies. We need one person to be brave and do the right thing by putting rubbish in the bin. What's up? <laughs> Yeah, I'll take it.